Yes, we do. I don't know. I'm just going to take a blind one if I can't tell you something. Oh, dang. I need guys, mate. All right, guys. So today we're kind of seeing how cut bait does compared to live bait, or live bait does compared to cut bait, or vice versa. So this side of the boat, I got two cut bait rods. This side of the boat, I got two live bait rods. That was something big just pop right in front of the boat. And uh, I got a live grunt on one rod and a live pinfish on the other. The two cut baits. I don't remember what the cut baits are. It's either grunt or pinfish because that's what we have in the well. So we're going to see which ones get hit first and which ones get the most hits on them or whatever one lands the most fish or the biggest fish. We'll see what happens. We're uh, kind of dealing with thunderstorms right now in Florida because there's like two hurricanes coming up the Gulf. So our weather's not been the greatest. We're trying to make do with what we got, but we're going to keep working at it. There's fish popping all around us. Just a moment of time before we get a bite. Ooh, the water's a lot cooler. We should have left 10 minutes ago. <laughs> All right, guys. So we started out on a flat. Sorry, got distracted. So we started out in a flat and we had two redfish hook up, but the hook swung back into the bait and we didn't hook up. Happens. So we pushed down to this oyster bar where there's a deep trough and we usually the fish will come into this deep trough. Well, right now they're hanging right on the outskirts of the oyster bar. So they're hanging right in this area. So we got cut baits soaking because we've been using live baits and nothing's been touching them. So we got cut bait soaking, and we're gonna see if we can't pick up a couple different, a couple more redfish before we call tonight, or before the rain pushes us out of this place. But we're gonna keep fishing and see what happens. At least the boat's gonna get washed. Wasn't a snook. It was a red. Rod holders hold. And the cooler wouldn't even latch down. I like it. That sucks. I don't understand this, man. Never had a problem running 30. Not once. We lost more fish on 30 this year than I can care to count. Not make any. Oh! That's a live bait? No, it's a cut bait, dude. It's a little. That's a mangrove. Yeah. It's a mangrove snapper. That's a good size one. That's a good mang. 
Ate the cup bait. <laughs> oh man. Well, mangrove snappers. Look at him. Do 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 do. Yeah. Yep. 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 That's my bull redfish. Yeah, I just boat it. I got a GoPro in my hand. That other, I got the GoPro, man. So if you just want to set stuff up right now, get that one in. This is a better fish for real. Oh, this is a better fish. This is a better fish. This is a better fish. Uh, maybe this live bait right over here. I gotta get him in past this. Nope, nope. Yeah, I got past it. I got past that. Got him close enough in. I got him close enough in. Come on, baby. Dude, I'm standing there getting the camera out. It bows all across my neck. <laughs> Never fails. The GoPro literally just died, guys. I went to grab another battery. This rod bowed across my neck. And I think we have a big redfish on. Digging. That's a good red, man. He is digging. Is it a red? Yeah, that's a red. I hope it's red. I, I know it's red. I've already seen it. Where's old Nettie? In the back. Nice red. He's not that big. He's not terribly big, but nice red. <sighs> I'm over here. Actually, I think I can land him. All right. I think I can land him. I think I can land him. You could have just grabbed him by the leader. He's not that big. Knowing me, it will bust right then and there. He's 26. Just set the net down and just open the bail. Not a terrible fish here, guys. So we have live bait out and cut bait, and we have got nothing on the live bait. And we've got all of our hits tonight on the cut bait. Beautiful night out here tonight. It's me and Dustin just hanging out on the boat. Nice little inshore fishing trip after work. We're gonna put this guy on the tape and see what he measures out at. Did I call her 26? 26. 26 man I called it on the money <laughs> 26 inch red right here guys we're gonna get a quick picture and get this guy back in the water so he can swim off nice and healthy kicked off nice and healthy here it's just an amazing night right now nice Friday after work Sunset's really looking good. And cut bait's doing the trick for us on these redfish here. We probably got another 30 minutes or so of sunlight, but we're gonna see if we can't pull another one here. We get Dustin on a nice one here. This is like an amazing grouper sized pinfish, man. That rod's getting hit. We're on. I'm a fishy. Hey, I caught a mangrove. Yes, sir. Lose the monsters to catch the dinkers. No, not terrible. A lot better than what we've been getting. Ooh, stop it. We found the redfish. All right, little guy. See ya. Rod gets slow as that. Just have bad experiences with fishing oyster bars this close. Well, they shoot out and around. And go, ding, ding. What other choice do we have? This is where they're feeding. That rod's eight. That rod's eight. That rod's eight. That's a snook, 
Dude. No way. I don't know where we're at here. Oh, he's gonna rat me. He's gonna rat me. Don't palm him. Don't palm him. We're gonna have to. We definitely gotta move. I'm working on it. I got a lot of line going. God, that's huge. You just came out the water. Oh, here we go. Yep. Break it? Yep. That's a 40, dude. Dude, there was nothing we could do there. We're gonna have to start fishing this with big slammers. Dude. All right, guys, that was an absolute heartbreak right there. Dustin was like, man, that rod's on. I reel it up, starts getting tight, he fights, and just domps that reel. I mean, that was a 40-inch snook all day, and I've never seen a snook completely air out of the water like that. I'm hoping the GoPro caught it, but, you know, we're going to see what happens. But we are running out of daylight right now and water, so we're probably going to end up pushing the boat off the flat, but that's all right. If you guys enjoyed this video of us kind of fishing live bait versus cut bait, Make sure you guys hit that thumbs up. Weather in Florida has really kept us off the water. We're trying to put out videos, but if you live in Florida, you know it has been nasty every single day, every single weekend. And nine times out of ten, our plans don't go the way we want to go. So we're trying to put out videos, so just bear with us until the next one. We'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Get wet, princess! Shy a cough. I say I paid for a charter to get out and push. You just need to get your damn your damn muscles moving. Ooh. Uh, okay, I'm here to help. Let muscle ball get behind her. I gotcha. I know you're weak. <sighs> Big ass rock we were sitting on. Oh yeah. Alright. Let's get her going. Everything you got to the channel marker. Ready? Ready? One, two, three. Yeah.